How does this relate to the French musical? Well, I, I don't think it does. I think it was an isolated uh, film which uh, obviously the producer uh, very much wanted to see made. Uh, but I don't think uh, anybody saw it as part of a tradition of French movie making. Uh, and I can't think of there being very many other uh, French musicals, which is surprising when one considers that uh, uh, this had broken down the barrier of getting a distribution in uh, in England, on a circuit distribution. Um, but perhaps the costs were too great uh, to for it to be done regularly at all, and really the only other. French musicals that one can see are uh, Le Parapluie de Cherbourg and uh, Les Demoiselles de uh, La Rochelle, was it? No, whatever it was. Uh, the films that Jacques Demy made, which were very much uh, derived from the American uh, musicals uh, rather than from any French tradition. So uh, I, I think this can be seen very much more in the pre war slightly pessimistic films of uh, Prévert and Carnet, uh, with which Gabin was very much associated, uh, and, and uh, that uh, there was this strain of, uh, of melancholy and, and pessimism which is there in uh, French Cancan, uh, that uh, Alexander attempts to commit suicide, and eventually has to return to his own kingdom, uh, a disappointed man. Uh, that seems to me to come very much more uh, akin to the, uh, the, the the tradition of French movies uh, than the, the the singing and the dancing, which uh, do remain so memorable in in French Can Can. But I think they were. Uh, the decoration on uh, the, the narrative, um, and that the, it was the narrative which, which really was uh, sustaining a, a, a tradition of French movie making.